Fit Pals TV. We are here with Tom Doc and Stewie joins us now. And I'm holding in my hand questions from viewers. My favorite segment. <laughs> well, people have a lot of questions. They do. And I picked mm -hmm. out some that I thought you should answer. Now, okay. what we're going to do is Tom is going to highlight the answers and then, of course, keep calm, contact Tom, go to our website Great. for, for in-depth. Perfect. Okay. Tom, question. Color to avoid in dog food. What color should we avoid? Wow, so color in dog food. Why is there color there in the first place? Okay, oh. because they're not really seeing a lot of colors. No. They see blues, yellows, greens, not so much the reds, oh, okay. okay? So this all goes back to, gosh, is red dye, is yellow dye, are all these problems, and we see kind of, does it cause hyperactivity in children? And the jury's still out, but you know what? I did a little research, okay? okay? Most of the dyes are in your grocery store brands, yeah. you know, your big box brands. Yeah. Just ask your veterinarian, what's a good brand that's maybe sold in a pet store or at a veterinary office mm -hmm. that's not gonna have a dye? You can see it right on the label. Mm -hmm. Just if you wanna avoid it, it's fine. It doesn't really hurt them, but if you wanna, okay. you can avoid it. All right, good point. Also, they put the dyes in to make it look more appealing to us. To us, exactly, because yeah, they don't care, yeah. Uh, pig's ears. I mean, every time I open my Facebook page, somebody's saying, don't buy any pig's ears. <laughs> Another recall or scare, something scary. Pig's ears, what's going right. on? Right, so we've had three of these recalls this year so far. Wow. Okay. Yeah. At 2019, right. And so what's happening is you get these big boxes of pig ears, the retailers do, uh -huh. and they're, they're not packaged separately. They're just all thrown into a box, yeah. and they're mixed into a big big bin, yep. and so you get some from different countries, you get some from here, um, and now all of a sudden, we've got salmonella all throughout. So there's been 143 people, not pets, but people that have been infected with the salmonella huh. that they can trace it back okay. to. Yeah, and that can cause a big problem for us. Not so much for our pets, but it can. It can cause some diarrhea in a pet, especially if they're immunocompromised. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So right now, if it's a bulk bin type item, don't buy it. Don't buy it. Uh, this is very important. We can say this on a pet show. Why do dogs eat poop? <laughs> Why do dogs eat poop? That's a common he, question. When he was a puppy, mm -hmm. the kitties, kitty litter. Kitty area. litter, yeah. So it's Doesn't not only anymore. their own poop or their friend's poop, it's the other species' poop. Why? Okay. Why do they do that? You know, it's a behavior. It really is. Some people will say, oh, he's deficient in this, that, or the other thing. But you know what? You're feeding him a good food. And so I know he's not deficient in any kind of no, nutrients, no. okay? This is a learned behavior. Uh, Sometimes it's, let's keep myself clean, keep my area clean, uh -huh. or maybe, and I hate to think this kind of thing, but sometimes people are still, let's put their nose in it because oh. they were bad, uh -huh. and so the dog's cleaning it up oh. so quickly so that he doesn't have to go through that again. So, and they can get infected with things if they with, eat other mm -hmm. dogs' Parasites stuff. that Parasites. can affect us, too. Roundworms, hookworms, your whole family can okay. be infected. So very important, you don't let this happen. Keep them on a leash, or if it's in the backyard, just go out and scoop it immediately. Don't Pick wait. It. Pick it up, as Pick we say. Up. Okay, mm -hmm. dogs are omnivores. What are cats? So cats are obligate carnivores. So what that means is obligate. Obligate. They Never have to that. have some meat in their diet. They must okay. have exactly. And the reason for that is they nature has designed them in such a way that they don't have the same enzymes that dogs do, mm -hmm. and so it's harder for them. They can't make vitamin A on their own. They have to have preformed vitamin A, which is often found in animal tissue. Uh -huh. There's an essential fatty acid, arachidonic acid. They cannot make that yeah. on their own. So again, it goes back to animal fat has a lot of arachidonic right, right. acid. Tom, you're wonderful. Uh, he gave you a lot of information, but there's even more. Yes, there is. Go to our website, petpalstv.com. Uh, keep calm, contact Tom, and ask him questions too. Yeah, Thank I'm you again. I'm happy to answer it. You're so good. Thanks. You're so chatty and Thank full you. of information. I oh, that's a good thing, right? That. That's a good <laughs> that's thing. A good... <laughs> oh, he's a good thing. All right, we'll be back with more on Pet Pals TV. <laughs>